What is up you guys? Welcome back to another video. As you can tell, we're back riding the skateboard again. And uh, the reason we're doing this is because in the last video, or if you, have, if you haven't seen the last video, I was talking about um, this board and all the problems that I had with it. And basically telling X-Ray to get their act together and fix this problem. Because I had people in my comment section and all kinds of, and, and other people's comment sections and, and um, other people made uh, videos about having the problem is that the board like when you get it out of the box it just stops working and it's not a good thing but i'm not going to get too far into that for the simple fact of uh, i already made a whole video talking about that but the reason i'm making this video is because in that video um a lot of people were telling me in the comments it's an easy fix all you have to do is um uh update the uh the board with a what the newest uh, and latest model of uh, an iPhone or the newest and latest model of a Samsung phone or an Android. So, um, and I have the Samsung Galaxy S10. And when I got this board, this that was Samsung's newest phone. Since then, Samsung has put out another phone, but it's still a brand spanking new phone. I've literally only had it for a few months. So, uh, and basically what I told those people is that if you're, I need to fix my uh, my mic. I keep hitting it with my chin. Uh, I basically told those people that if you're going to buy a $1,000 skateboard, you shouldn't have to buy another $1,000 phone, which, uh, I don't know if you guys agree with me, but I, that's completely true. You shouldn't have to spend that much money, uh, buy a phone to have your skateboard work. It's really dumb. So... Uh, and then those people were eventually like, yeah, okay, whatever. It works. That's fine. Um, and you guys are probably watching this video, and I wasn't trying to be mean. I was just stating that you shouldn't have to spend all that money for an, escape, for an electric skateboard. And um, I also had people telling me that I was recording, uh, that I was blocking people and blocking comments and stuff. That's because you guys were writing super long, um, like super long paragraphs and stuff, and then kept uh, commenting after one after another and um, YouTube YouTube's algorithm catches that and makes it spam that's not me I'm not doing that it's YouTube's um, like algorithm or code or whatever the heck you want to call it it's it's them doing it so the uh, it's that's not me that's YouTube and the problem with the board is that um, it just stops working and people again were telling me well that's uh, that's not, that's like your fault. It's not X-Ray's fault, but really, it I shouldn't have to spend that much money. What was that? It's got motors on it. It'll go like 25. <laughs> Yeah, it's got motors on the bottom, and then it's got a controller. Yeah, it moves, bro. <laughs> no, nah, there's no way. <laughs> you have a good day, guys. <laughs> you gotta love it. Okay, so like I was saying, um... Uh, you shouldn't have to buy a brand new phone for your skateboard to work and that's why and I had people telling me that before I made the, that video I already knew that that was gonna be a thing that people were gonna say and I don't think you should have to buy a brand new phone to make your skateboard work and hopefully most of you agree with me on that because you really shouldn't have to I know I just keep saying this it's just really dumb that x-ray would do this like uh that you can that you have to have a newer phone or whatever i don't know it might i'm sorry if you guys can hear a lot of wind i need to put my goggles back on but it's getting a little dark so I, it's kind of awkward having the tinted goggles on but it's just kind of annoying is all it is and what's also really weird is that video is the fastest growing video on my youtube channel that video had like 40 views and like 10 hours and usually i get maybe like 10 views in 10 hours that's like a view an hour but I usually don't get very many views very quickly and on that video it had 40 views in a few hours and as of the as of the time I'm filming this it's at like 70 or 80 views and it's been out for a few days I really need to put my goggles on uh, um, 
because if I can hear the wind really loud, you guys probably can too. I'm sorry about that. But um, that's the whole reason I came out here to film this video, riding the board, and have my camera in my hand, even though I'm probably not going to end up filming on it, and um, not filming another, not filming a, another video, which I was planning on doing this week like I really wanted to. And instead, I have to film this video, and uh, I mean, I don't exactly have to, it's just a good idea just to address it, because in that video, I forgot to mention um, that I did do the update with a brand new phone, and the reason I forgot to mention that is because, um, are you going to go? Yeah. The reason I forgot to mention that is because I had to film the video twice. I had to film the video twice. I didn't know that truck was behind me. Uh, as I've said like five times, I had to film the video twice because the first one, I didn't like how it turned out because I didn't exactly have my facts straight. So um, I didn't exactly know what I was saying. So I was kind of just rambling, rambling and kind of repeating myself like I am in this video because I don't exactly know what I'm saying. I literally just got home a few minutes ago and I'm like, okay, I'm gonna film this video because it needs to go up and it's Tuesday and this video needs to go up So on Saturday. So I figured I would come out here now and film this because I really need to. And um, that's why I never said that I tried that I did the update with a brand new phone is because I had said it in the previous and the uh, first recording of the video and I hadn't and I didn't notice that I didn't say it in the second one. That's why oh my gosh why'd I come down here and that's why I never mentioned that. So I hope you guys understand what I'm saying but uh, you guys you guys can have your own opinions that doesn't that doesn't bother me. It's okay if you guys want to in the comment section say, uh, that I'm still say that I'm wrong. That's fine. That's your opinion. I'm not gonna get mad at you for that as you could tell I wasn't like deleting comments or anything uh, YouTube might have done it. I don't know, but that wasn't me I wasn't deleting comments because I like all your guys' feedback even if it's not positive feedback I, li I still like the feedback because I like to know you guys' opinions especially when it comes to a product like this where the other people that are watching this video to get information will read those comments and, and want to know what is happening. Like what the, by that I mean like the problems and stuff that people are having and hear it from other perspective than, than a YouTuber that uh, may, or not, may or may not be getting paid to say things. And I definitely am not, I swear, I am not getting paid by Expo to say these things because if I was, they wouldn't be letting me say that the board ha is having problems and all these things. They wouldn't be letting me say that because they want me to say good things about the board. They wouldn't be paying me to say bad things about their product unless they're a company like that. Some companies do. They tell you, hey, say your honest opinion, and usually their product's still really good. But still, the problems that I've been having with this board, that I had with this board, and that I'm still kind of having with this board to this day, uh, and the problems that other people are having, oh my gosh, I just saw this truck, and the problems that other people are having are real things, and it's not, no, it's not fake. We wouldn't be, you know, giving you guys false information that's, like, negative. Um, so, and the weird thing is, from, I've, I searched the internet, I searched Google, I searched YouTube for all kinds of other people, and in other comment sections of, and, and in comment sections of the videos that I watched before I bought this board and nobody ever said that they had any problems with it and I I don't know maybe it's a it's a new thing that's just popping up because those videos were all made when the board first came out and mine was made a while after because this board's been out for a while I I don't know it could be a number of things and there is no definite reason or I would tell you guys that and there's no definite way to fix it because if there was you guys would know I would tell you and other people would tell you and there wouldn't be so many people having problems but I, I don't know and to all of those of you that were in my comment section telling me how to fix the problem and that I'm wrong on what I'm saying and this and that or whatever you guys were saying I did read the comments and I answered most all of them <laughs> but uh, thank you guys for you know saying these things because without you you would because <laughs> without you guys you, there would be no video right now for you guys to watch. There wouldn't be, you guys wouldn't be watching this video because the only reason I made this video is because I had those people telling me uh, how to fix the board and this and that and that I was wrong and stuff and all of that kind of stuff. So I, I don't I don't really know what else to say. I guess that's pretty much all I had to say for this video. Um, it's kind of annoying that X-Way made a product like this, but well, it's 
I, I don't take that the wrong way. Really, what I'm trying to say is that there's a, they make a product that's extremely expensive, and then it just doesn't work right out of the box. So I don't know what it is with that update, if that update messes it up, or if it's messed up anyways, or what it is. I really have no clue. Uh, it seems like all the people that had the problems, they did the update, like the first update you have to do when you get the board, and then it just stopped working, which is exactly what happened to me, because I, uh, I opened the box and stuff, and then I... Um, I turned it on, uh, revved the motors up a few times, and then I turned it off, downloaded the app, did the update, and then it stopped working. So I don't, I don't exactly know what to say, because there's, I don't understand how people are saying that you have to have a brand new phone for the update to work. I mean, I get it. If it works for some of you, it works for some of you, but of course it's not working for everyone, because that's what I freaking did, and it didn't do anything. It just made the problem worse. So after updating it, I don't know. It's kind of, it's really weird and kind of annoying, but uh, I don't exactly know what else to say uh, in this video because I know I'm just going to be repeating myself. So uh, I guess I'll see you guys in the next one. And I don't know why I'm carrying this camera around because I was expecting to go back to the same place I went last time when I filmed, when I filmed the last video, but I ended up going this way, which means I didn't even need to bring my camera. I'm just carrying it around and risking dropping it, but whatever. I'll see you guys in the next one. Hope you enjoyed it. Later. There it is. <laughs>